Hello everybody, Elijah here. Welcome you all to another Epic 7 video. And today we'll be kind of like at a mid showcase plus RTA plus, you know, all the good stuff. And I was wrong. When I did my summoning video, I told myself that I wasn't really going to build this hero. I probably wasn't going to have fun with her. I probably didn't really need to use her or whatever the case may be. And I was completely wrong because she has been a lot of fun. I'm going to show you guys some highlight videos or more so replays of me testing her out in RTA and just the team comps that I was doing or testing her with and it was just a lot of fun. So yeah, um, this is her build. I know most people tend to build their emits at like 300 speed or something crazy crazy fast and try to go first. For me, I feel as though building her to go after most openers and with a super high ER is a lot better and then pairing her with somebody who is either also an opener like your rans the hawks um c lilius whatever the case may be and pairing her with that or somebody like the hawk that can also cleanse so you have like two cleansers i've been pairing her with the hawk they work out very well together because you know she can cleanse somebody and he can also cleanse somebody and cr push somebody and they're kind of like forced to choose between the two if they say they have a C Lilius, they're probably going to reverse provoke the Zahawk, but then she cleanses him and then he cleanses somebody else and then I continue on with my cleave, right? That's typically how I've been kind of setting up my drafts lately and all that good stuff. I have built up several new units. Uh, Kise, I've built up my spec says again. Basically the units that have some type of already built in 50% CR push to synergize with her... A swift attack. So yeah, let's go ahead and show you guys some of the videos or some of the showcases of me using her just because I feel as though if I queued up an RTA while I'm recording and showed you guys, you know, me using her, it would probably just go wrong. It would probably just uh, not work out. But anyway, we're going to start off. Oh, wait. Oh, uh, hold on. Because I am I was on my phone when I uh, showed those. There's, the, here we go. We could just, we could just go through guild chat and look through here. Because apparently I can't show you guys those unless I'm on my phone as well. You dare defy me? Anyway, Ever? here we have Zio going first, obviously. And because she has high ER... I don't necessarily have to worry about Zio um, silencing me. Now he does go for strays, uh, but I 15% <laughs> the cleanse or the pushback, which I don't think would make too much of a difference. Like it would just mean that a mid would go, like she would go before the strays and then push him up. So again, we have like two CR pushers. And they kind of just like synergize and like work well together. And I injured the Bellians so that I would one shot the Destina, right? And then that's it for Destina. And then I kill the Zeo. And now, K Ron is probably on counter set. That being said, if you were to counter attack, I think I could have lost this match. But even with that, because of the invincibility that I have on everybody and the skill null, I'm like fine. Right? Because, you know, I didn't really know who to use her. I kind of. <laughs> it's funny because she didn't really do anything. <laughs> but she did because she was able to apply skill nullifier, which essentially, you know, made it so that Kron can't do anything here. So, like, even though she didn't do much, she still did a lot. Do you know what I mean? Like, her presence was enough to win this in the end. Here's another example of somebody, you know, obviously outspeeding me. But it didn't really matter because, again, they have to, like, focus one of the cleansers, right? Or one of the CR pushers. Whether that be Zahawk or that be a mid. And, like, you're not debuffing a mid, but you probably will... I think she did just debuff Zaha. 
And then I just go on and do my usual, you know, combo. I grant skill null. Now, to be completely honest, the best thing I think that this, um, that that C. Lilius should have done was S3 and then S1 into Zahak or Kisei. I think that would have been the best thing for them. Just because if they pulled Vildred, Vildred would go crazy. You know, he would kill somebody and then S2 and then probably like wipe the entire team. So like even though Zahak did miss his, um, like he missed his turn, it still is fine. Because with the skill null, Remnant Violet can't really do anything, you know. Forced to hit Apoc, right? I guess he could have hit anybody else. And then I could just kill their Vildred. And even with their Vildred, even if he did go, right? If he did take the turn, it didn't matter because he just didn't do... He wouldn't be able to do any damage. You know, Zahak lives here. And even if he didn't live, I don't really think it mattered. It wouldn't really make much of a difference. To be completely honest. I think he still would have been fine. Because I don't think Rylet is going to be able to solo a Apoc Ravi. I'm just going to be completely honest. <laughs> and given my team, it would only take one hit. Like either Kisei hitting him one time or... Apoc Robbie hitting him one time and he would be dead just like instantly. I can still endure. But yeah, those are some of the. I wish I could show you guys. I wish I could show you guys this match as well, but I would have to, you know, get it from my phone because I can't do it, show it from my computer. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and get into some RTA matches actually and see if I can, I while recording, show you guys. How awesome a mid is, or not get the opportunity to. We'll see. We will see. Um, I've been banning Lua and AOL because Lua, she can soul burn, right? That's like the big issue with Lua. Like she can soul burn, ignore ER, and your mid is now useless. What cannot be avoided must be avoided. Whereas, um, Take your life. AOL, the issue with AOL is just that she, you know, she counters my, like, AOE team strategies and all that good stuff. So we picked C. Lilia, so we're going to pick Zahak. We get started? We're going to pick Zahak, and we also could pick Strays here, right? It seems like they're playing slower, I would like to assume. So we could pick Strays here, um, or Kisei. I like to save Commander Pavel for like last, just in case, but I think we, I think we go Strays here. Strays can't be counterattacked with his S3, you know, just like things like that. They pick Solitaria. Um, it's not really much of an issue with Solitaria. I could... Pick an anchor, like Ed, because I think that would be fun. I haven't really tried her with like an anchor like that, but yeah, we'll just pick Ed and see how that works. And I think I need, okay, so if I were to get rid of, I think I just picked DJB here, right? Will I do enough damage? I don't think so. I think I would need like somebody, like something else, like a cleanser or something. So we're gonna pick designer Lilibet. And I think with this, we just ban laughs. Yeah. I think we have enough AOE to kill Spectre. Oh, they ban mid. That sucks. I think we're fine. I, I, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna gaslight myself and saying that we're fine here, but I think we're fine. I just wanna go home. 
Oh, I actually almost... I almost outspent their... I did outspent their C. Lilius, but I almost outspent their... Uh... Oh, that really sucks. He did not get pushed back. Like, that is so lucky for them. Like, actually. <laughs> That's, like, actually lucky for them. It's crazy. Okay, so this happens. Oh, wow. I'm being... That's interesting. I would have just uh, went for... I would have just went for the... What is it? I would have just went for the, uh, what am I trying to say? I would have just went for the pushback on the designer a little bit. That's what I'm trying to say. I was like, I can't think. Okay, so she can soul burn to kill the hawk, but... Unless she's on lifesteal, I think she's kind of... I think she's screwed. Oh, resistance. Alright, this should kill the Spectre, right? Oh, oh my gosh, it didn't. Oh, but this will. <gasps> Wait! Why it did- Oh my gosh. That's crazy. Okay, so this should kill the specter. And like, you have to hit. Um, unless you just don't debuff Ed somehow. Yeah. Yeah, I think Ed was a really good pick there for an anchor. And this is actually the first time I've used Designer Lilibet, and I won a match. <laughs> so, I think that's a win-win for me. I would have pushed back Designer Lilibet, to be honest. Um, that's what I would have done. I don't know why they didn't do that. But I guess it's because they wanted to kill the Strays, because Strays was going to take the turn regardless. So, I don't know. Uh, my Sahak almost outsped everybody, which would have probably done more harm than good. I don't know if, if my Zahog actually outsped that would have been a good thing or a bad thing. I wasn't expecting their solitary to be that fast, though, to be honest. So I don't have first pick. So this should be interesting. Uh, I, I don't know what's going to happen. They could probably pick a mid. And I have not gone up against one. Okay, they picked DJB. That's fine. Uh, we're going to pick a mid. And we're going to pick the hog. That's what we're going to do. You know what's crazy? Even though, like, Amid and Ran are, like, the couple or whatever, I just think that she works better with the hog. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, they pick K-Ron. Funny, funny K-Ron. I don't want to deal with this. I'm going to go with something a little different. I might try to pick Blair Witch. Um... I think we're going to still... We're going to go Kisei. We're going to go Kisei. And we're going to go... I think I need something that's also fast. Let's try Blair Witch. We're going to do that because I can... Uh, well, I guess I won't have enough souls. So I can't, like, soul burn. 
Uh, ignore ER. Um, that's fine. I mean, unless they're banning Kisei, like, that's perfectly fine. Should I pick Remnant Violet or is that Troll? Do I pick Remnant Violet or is that Troll? I'm thinking about picking Remnant Violet. Actually, now when I think about it... I could probably just go Strays, right? I think Strays would be nice, because Strays can give himself invincibility. Um, yeah. Alright, Strays can give himself invincibility. He also can not be countered. I think I will be fine. I should... If I don't outspeed the DJB, I lose, though. That's the problem. And she's not super fast. So if they ban the Hawk, I'm kind of like doomed, right? Ooh, this is dead. This is tough. Um, we're going to ban DJB. Okay. And we're going to see how... Uh, I should be faster than everybody on that field, I think. We're going to see how... Uh, how everybody holds up. So we're going to... We're going to kill the Selene. We're going to kill the Selene, get her out of here. An eternal night will reign. Um, I don't trust myself with killing... This is me hoping that their ambitious Tywin has the highest HP. <laughs> Please. Okay. And then we do this. Um. Oh, wow. I actually got the strip off. That's crazy. That was... That was clean. I like how this isn't a mid showcase, but has she's she has not got through the draft. <laughs> she hasn't gotten through the draft. I don't know. Um, she hasn't gotten through. Luckily, I had those videos of those highlights before, but you know it is what it is. So we're gonna first pick her. Maybe she'll get through this time. Oh, <gasps> shut up! Is this the same person? Well, I guess for the sake of this this situation, let's do something different. Let's pick C. Lilius. Come. I'll take your life. You know, I don't want to slow down. I want to continue playing aggro. Um, oh, that makes sense. Picking Destina here. So what I want to do about this? Um, I'm going to pick the hawk because. Yes. And I think I'm going to pick Strays. Because he can't be counterattacked. So, yeah. Those first two units don't really bother me. At all. I'm going to continue playing. Uh, uh, Spectre doesn't really bother me. Landy... Landy is a little... Well, this is a good moment for Mila. I like rarely get to use Mila. Right, that first... Yeah, we can pick Mila here. And then I want to pick... Somebody that can see our push as well. Somebody that can see our push. It might sound crazy, but I am looking at Bihu. I am looking at Bihu, but I probably should pick Ning Ning. Probably should pick Ning Ning. Yeah, we're gonna go with Ning Ning. 
ready? Uh, and I just banned last. I don't see the first four beating me unless this is like a 300 speed landy or something crazy. Like, I just don't. The landy also could be super tanky. So that's also another thing. The landy could be really tanky. But I think I'm fine. I kill the Aiden. Strays kills this. Milum can deal with that. You know, it's just the typical... Ooh, it was a speed landy. Okay. That's what I thought. Prove your worth. Oh! <laughs> well, that's that, it seems. Um, <laughs> that's that, it seems. Okay. We'll play one more. A lot of these matches are going super fast because I'm playing aggro. So it just is how it works. I also haven't lost a match in a while for I also because I'm probably just way too low in the ranks. I probably should not be masters at the moment, but I have not played much RTA. Okay, they're banning Blair Wish, so they're probably playing slow. I would like to pick Spec says. I think that's fun. I think that'll be fun. Rimuru. Rimuru is actually probably the biggest counter to this. Like, probably, like, Rimuru will make a resurface if the mid is super, you know, meta. Because Rimuru definitely just craps on teams like this. So I think I have to ban Rimuru. Okay, so... This is where things get funny. This is where things is going to get a little funny. Eliminate you. And we're doing this. I might keep Rimuru in, to be honest, and just one-shot him. Actually, I can't. I literally can't. I, 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 I don't think I can. Am I ban Sid? Yeah, I might be banning Sid. Celius, Celius isn't a problem if they don't ban. Celius is only a problem if they. Hmm. I fight with the power of all. So it it looks as though they're banning Zahok. And if that's the case. Hmm. Yeah, we'll just bake an anchor here. Um, and I'm gonna ban... I'm gonna ban Sid. How am I gonna hit Aiden? I just banned C. Lilius. I should have banned Sid. Ooh, this might be bad. I was like, I'm thinking about it. I'm just like, I should have just... I don't know. We'll see. Um, if I use a hog, I don't... Unless the Sid is like... Super fast. Resist as much as you can. Yeah. So we're just gonna... Oh, but Karina is gonna push up. Ooh, this is bad. But I have to I have to get rid of the Sid. Like I just have to. She pushes up. Thankfully, she won't kill anybody. 
Uh, my spec size actually has pretty decent HP. Like, 11k? So I don't think he should die. Never mind. Never mind. I I don't know what I'm talking about. I do, I clearly do not know what I'm talking about. Um. We're gonna give you that. So how do we win this? I like how the one match we get in mid, we're like, <laughs> we're we're definitely losing. Oh, this is an ER. Rima, I'm gonna lose my mind. Don't do this to me. It is. <sighs> of course it is. Like, I... My Solitaria has quite literally... Like, he has to have, like, 200-something ER to resist. Oh, that is... Interesting. Um... That is interesting. Let me tell you. Prove your worth. Um. I'm not losing this ability anyway. I'll finish this soon. What? Oh wow. Oh wow. Okay, Zahak, you're letting me down too. Okay, yeah. That's crazy. Honestly, it's, what's even more crazier is just the sheer amount of speed that Karina had and still one shot pathetic. my spaz. Um, so we're going to do one more and then we're going to call it. Oh, I just needed to live. I If I lived that hit, I think I could have won. But anyway, we're going to conclude that, I guess, I don't even know if it was, I don't even know if I could call this an, a mid showcase because, like, I barely got to use her. But anyway, if you did enjoy, please remember to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace out.